education in the ancient world was basically of two types. You had a technical education in which the student was taught uh, to uh, produce an object, some art or craft, or he was taught to do a job. And then you had a liberal education uh, in which uh, a student was taught um, virtue and to study the best that man had written uh, or said in philosophy and art and music and literature. Technical education was basically job training. You were being trained to perform a function or produce an object. The liberal education, on the other hand, was training you to be more fully human, to be complete as a human being. And finally, the technical education was for slaves. The liberal education was for free men. The classical learning test, which our students uh, take each year, is a standardized college entrance test, much like the SAT or the ACT. However, the distinguishing feature is that it's designed for students who have had this classical or liberal educational training, as opposed to more technical uh, educational training. Uh, the classical learning test, the CLT, is basically for students who are pursuing virtue and what it means to be more fully human, as opposed to those who are pursuing skills that will lead them to job training. And I'm very pleased to announce that uh, out of over 1,200 schools who take the CLT test each year, Mars Hill Academy has uh, proven to be the, the number one school in the country for the second year in a row. That is tremendously good news. I'm very pleased to make that announcement to you and very proud and humbled to be a part of this great work and to work with these students and my colleagues on the faculty and staff and administration for their, so I wanna thank them for their very hard work and uh, say congratulations uh, to all of you students and parents for all of your diligent labors. It really has paid off. Uh, this is quite something to be um, pleased with, to be grateful to the Lord about, and yeah, in a humble sort of way, to be very proud of.